And we are back with Business Radio X Pro Tips. Lee Cantor, Stone Payton here with you. Lee, we're always, as entrepreneurs, business owners, senior execs, and ongoing concerns, you know, we're, uh, we're, we're twisting the dials. We're trying to dial things in and, and, and make adjustments. But it's key, I think, that, that we adjust our strategies and particularly our marketing and networking strategies to our audience. Right. I think it's important uh, to communicate in the language of which you are dealing. So if you're dealing with accountants, for example, you might tell uh, same story, same anecdote, same case studies, but use different words and d- use different language with the accounts than you would if you were selling that same thing to advertising creatives. The, your philosophy isn't really going to change, but the language you use and the words you use and the way that you communicate will change. And um, I think it's a mistake to think that you can speak the same way and use the same words and examples with different types of people. You have to adjust to the type of person you're dealing with. So if they're super analytical and number oriented, you should be adjusting your case study or testimonial or social proof accordingly. If they're more creative or more vision or future focused, you should adjust your story to use that kind of language and to use those kind of words and imagery to help them really connect with the, the story you're trying to tell. So the example might be the same, but the words and the language uh, might be totally different. So keep that in mind. The next time you have a sales pitch or you're talking to a prospect, listen to the words they're using, listen to the, the way that they prioritize what's important to them and then adjust your story to fit into their patterns.